Hello, our citizens. My name is Chris. I'm a brain education instructor from Torrance, California. Thank you for joining me for this series of the eight brocades. This is our second flow. This one is called drawing the bow. This is good for opening our lungs, our chest, reducing a little neck and shoulder pain and back pain. So let's go and start to get into the practice. We're going to bring our feet about shoulder width and just gently start to bounce. So first we want to start to activate the energy. So feel your feet, bounce your knees, bounce your hips, exaggerate your shoulders. You can turn your head a little bit, <sighs> breathe out with your mouth. So first thing we need to do is activate the energy, really connect our mind to our body. So we start to feel the condition, the happy places, the unhappy places, and focus on the unhappy places, bounce them, <sighs> shake them. You can twist a little bit more. You can breathe out through your mouth, <sighs> making a little sound. However you need to uh, adjust your body to help it feel better, <sighs> bring your focus there. So as we assess our body, we can learn more and more how the condition is and, and where we need to put our focus. Good. So is your body tight today, loose today? Good. And slowly stop. Feel the buzzing and tingling and then slowly bring our feet very close together. We're coming back to our zero point, our center. This is gonna be our home position. Feet together, knees slightly bent. Tuck your tailbone, lift your sternum, reach your crown for the sky. You wanna feel as if you're stacking the bone very well so that the muscles can relax as much as possible. Now your current condition may not feel very relaxed. You might find tension in places and that's normal. This home spot is going to be our assessment so that after the flow, you can feel the changes better, tighter, looser, but you become aware of how the practice is changing your body condition. Take a deep breath in, feeling expansion. Every cell, every muscle, every tissue expands. And as you exhale, releasing, letting go of all excess, physical, emotional. Inhale, expanding. Exhale. Good job, one more time. And now, I'd like to shift the weight onto your left foot. I'm mirroring for you, so your right foot's gonna open wide into a wide horse stance. I'm gonna do both feet so I can be centered for you guys. So sit into your legs. So if your body condition is amazing, you might sit really deep. If yours is not as amazing, you might be very tall, but you want to find your best posture. Push the earth, little bend in the knees. We don't want our knees to do this. Not comfortable, not good for me. Push them out like you're open and then tuck your tailbone. Feel that solidness in your legs. So in this first video showing you the flow, I'm going to give you the pieces so that when we do the full flow, you can understand and move with more centeredness. So sit in. So Drawing the bow, it's like a bow and arrow. So with my right hand, I'm gonna make my arrow hand look like an L. Large intestine meridian and lung meridian extended. My other three knuckles, I'm gonna bend at the first knuckle so it looks like this. So this hand is gonna come here. This is gonna be my arrow hand, it's gonna push out. This is gonna be my bow drawing hand. It's gonna come over, it's gonna make a fist, and then it's gonna pull the bow. So when you're here, I want this elbow to try to touch that wall. I want that hand to try to touch that wall. So they're pulling away from each other. So can you feel a connection between the edge of this hand, arrow hand, elbow across your back? Good, opening those meridians there and pulling. So keep the elbow and arm parallel to the ground as best you can. Good, so can you feel a little stretch? Good, so we're gonna hold a little bit so you can feel what the body has to go through before we flow. So take a deep breath in and out. So now you're gonna open your arrow hand and you're gonna start to drag it across your body. Good, like you're moving through something heavy, coming across. As you come all the way over, it's gonna become your new bow hand. Your left hand now becomes your arrow hand. Make your L, bend your fingers. And then as you exhale, you're gonna push. Try to touch the wall with your palm. 
Try to touch the other wall with your elbow. Your gaze is way beyond the finger. There's vibration, there's discomfort, there's a lot of tension that might be bubbling up. So push through the hand, pull through the elbow. Good, keep that long straight spine. Good, we're gonna reverse the other way. So now open that arrow hand and start to drag it across your body. Becoming your new bow hand, make an arrow. As you exhale, pulling. Now, as we start to flow with our breath, next inhale, you start to draw the hand across your body. Inhale across. Make your bow hand, make your arrow. Exhale. Inhale, sweeping. Creating your new bow, your new arrow. And exhale. So I want you to find your breath. If your breath is shorter than mine, you might be moving a little bit faster than me. You might be moving a little slower than me if you have a nice long deep breath. Notice the temperatures changing in your body, the vibrations. The strength growing in the legs. The tension melting from the upper body. So as you fall into your flow, we'll all have little different uh, expressions. So we might move faster, we might transition a little differently. Most important is to breathe and move with your breath. Yours might speed up some days. It might slow down other days. We're going to do one more to each side. Finish, you can let both arms come out. Inhale up, bringing yourself back to your narrow home spence and pull down the energy. Let the arms hang, feet, they'll bend the knees, tuck the tailbone, lift the sternum, reach the crown. Feel your new condition. Temperature, fullness, lightness. Soreness. It's all real. Just feel your body. Does it feel different than your first zero point? Take a deep breath in. And out. in, expanding, and out, release, good, go ahead and rub your hands, feel the sensation in your palms, warm, smooth, soft, and then sweep off any heaviness you feel in your body, good, so thank you for joining me for the second flow in our eight brocade series that is drawing the bow. So please keep an eye out for the other seven flows and the full flow that will culminate the series. So thank you guys for joining. Keep feeling your body. 
And if you'd like to experience a full one hour brain education based class, check a local body and brain center near you. And if you're not near a body and brain center, please look into the online memberships through YouTube for Brain Education TV. Thank you so much.